We are back again live at the command center of the JW Solar USA. This is where we have right now, folks. So I haven't got the AC part of that. And the, the wires are not connected yet, but I can still be able to do charging. So we're going to be testing the MEARTR uh, stacking configuration here. I have all, most of the wires are already connected. As you guys can see right here, and we're running this 24 volt um, Nissan Leaf 5.544 kilowatt lithium. And uh, we just want to test it. And before I'm going to say I do a permanent install here, if you haven't seen, this is how the channel look, uh, the setup looks like. And uh, we can go ahead and try to fire up this main breaker here and see whatever, how the system is running here. Stay tuned. Watch these meters here and that one over there. Okay. The MEARTR just came on and there is a last one here and this one is up here and you can see all the LED, the, the LED flashing started dropping things around here and the inverter there you go both of them just kick in um let's see stun this uh the BMK turn the PT100 on. So power up is asking for the time. So um, I suppose we are now 1637 hours. Okay. This is how you go about it. So in a PM and the date is gonna be second month and today is the 17th, I suppose, and 2020. Okay. So you're saying the power is off. So we come back here, take a look at this guy and do the same thing here. 16. So it's supposed to be 38 now, I suppose. There we go, it's already correct, corrected. See so the inverters are off. So if we push the inverter, the inverters are all kicked in. They're up and you say the BMK is thinking it's doing that because um, the, uh, the system was off. So it doesn't know anything what is going on. You can see, say uh, we are sitting at uh, 29.86 volt. So um, the inverters are all running, you see it's pulsing. So, so that means they're working. Where's the light? There you go. See that pulsing? So that means everything is working. See so just uh, like a regular router. It's flashing, giving you everything. So it's um, sending power right now. So if we decide to turn the breaker on for the AC, there we go. You see both inverters kicked in because I haven't separated the inverters yet. Tell them. So which one is... They know by master or slave, I have to set all those configuration. They already detected that. That's what I'm saying. But well, it's pulling uh, 5 amps DC. And um, I can hear them. So that means uh, 
everything is working. I don't just like the wires. Okay, so this is what it is. We got it right, and you guys can see. Um, getting the inverter, inverter, the master goes to the master right here, which is number one. So the secondary one, which is the slave, this one here, this one here. Okay, this is the uh, this is the PT. This one is the PT100 right there. I think I have a bad connection. This wire, I think, is broken. Oh, yeah. Yeah, the thing that holds the, the little nipple that snaps here, I think, is broken. So I got to change this wire. So, um, and you have all the remotes, all the uh, sensors, uh, whatever, the remotes and the network cables. Uh, guys, this is all I have for you guys now, and you guys can see everything is flashing and is working. And I just want to thank you for watching this channel, and um, this is just a temporary look for you guys. And um, I have to make sure I got all the box so that I can bury those wires. I got to come up with a plan to mount out that router to something and um, I don't want to see those messy wires at all. All right, take care guys. Love you guys. Bye from Command Center GW Studio USA. Bye.